Hey, you guys, welcome back to Married to Film. Listen, here's part three. What's going on? My children left me. Don't you think they'll probably come back? No. I think my father is going to poison them against me. Mm -hmm. You're done your I had a terrible relationship with my father. He was a massive prick. He's dead now. But he hit my mother, he hit my sisters beat me and my brothers. There was a time there where it was either kill the man or join the church. Is that right? Thanks for that. You gonna join your daddy's church? Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> you gonna get baptized? Oh, is she giving the money to the church? What the heck is going on with her? Hey, John. Now, you're either going to let me in this hospital or I'm going to leave this building and I'm going to kill my father. Mm. So why don't you pass me that clipboard there? Let's get to know each other. Hmm? You're supposed to be going to see Navarro. Hey, you can stay at mine again tonight if you want. We can watch a Duck Dynasty and feel good about ourselves. <laughs> that does sound fun. <laughs> uh, well, uh, I got an errand to run, so uh, I'll bring home dinner. <laughs> you might not make it. Careful out there. Yep. You might not make it back. Do you, uh, do you need anything? No. What are you doing in here exactly? <laughs> did you tell the kids I'm in here? No. No, I did not tell the kids. I don't want to worry them. The whole point is to worry the kids. You know, we got that fundraiser in two days. Don't you want to be able to get ready for that, be rested? Tell the kids I'm in here. And, and what about Camilla? You know, we got this new deal with Camilla. Are you, you going to make me handle that all on my own? If I leave here, I'll kill him. Who? <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean, who? My dad. Look, he wasn't even okay. thinking about him. That's enough. He said, okay, that's enough. I'm not leaving here till I get my kids back. This chick is crazy. <laughs> You can't get your kids back if you're locked up in a behavioral health right. <laughs> oh. It's about to go down. Please have your gun with you. You know the Escalade don't play. Please have your gun with you. Cause you know, he, she was the right one. When she, when she walked up to you, she said, that's all you do. Mm -hmm. Ralph. Oh. Roof, no. No, 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 no. Oh, that's station. station. Okay. We need some place private to talk. I'll be in my office with Miss Langmore, if y'all need me. All right, then. Here's the deal. The man he got sitting in prison over there for Watt's murder, he didn't do it. Hold on one minute. Maybe you should get yourself a lawyer before you say anything else. No need. Mm -hmm. Go on, then. A motherfucker named Javi Alessandro did it. He works for the Navarro cartel, and he had them... The Navarro cartel. Can, can I, can I get through this, please? Yes. He had a problem with Darlene throwing heroin. And he shot her and Wyatt. And, and when I found that out, I hunted him down and, and killed him in That's Chicago. Sad. So, so the man's dead. Jesus Christ, Ruth. And, 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 and you ain't never gonna find him. And, and, and it might also interest you to know that Javi Alessandro killed Sheriff Nick. So you can take those billboards mm -hmm. down because you ain't never gonna find him. And here's the thing. If any DA or anyone ever comes at me and says that I said any of this shit to you, I'll deny it and tell them that you're crazy. And who will believe you anyway because it is crazy. Mm -mm. And you know how bad it looks? You getting all Darlene's money and then coming in here with a story about cartels and Chicago and dead cops. It's just what do you expect me to do here? Nothing. First of all, go ahead. 
and follow the money if you want. Because it ain't going to lead you to nowhere. None of it was about money to me. And you ain't never going to find any evidence because this is some high level shit. And I'm sorry to lay this all on you, but those are the facts. Mm -mm -mm. And I'm about to die. My point here is the man sitting in that jail cell ain't guilty of nothing but being poor and, and being an asshole. And half of that ain't even his fault. Mm. He didn't do it. Mm. There's a fuckload of politics in your job. But right is right. You're gonna be a good sheriff, Ronnie. Be careful driving home. Slicker and spit out. Mm. You ain't tell him about the man sitting outside? Mm. Look in the back seat. Why is she scared now? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gonna call Rachel? Yeah. Yeah. And she really is watching Duck Dynasty. <laughs> I miss it. Oh my God, Rachel. Slow down. Slow down. I got Duck Dynasty on. It's really good. Okay, yeah. You need to listen to me. What's the matter? No, 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 you, you need to get out of there. Nelson, the guy who fucked with you the other day, he's coming after me and he'll find you. Wait, what? Just, just, please, listen to me. <laughs> Go to the closet, get the rifle, and then you need to fucking run into the woods and you just keep running. Fuck. All right, I got it. My shoes. Just forget about your fucking shoes. Fuck. Come here, drive. Well, get out of the house! Just get behind the trailer. Run now. Get under the house! <laughs> fucking nightmare. Just go. Just fucking move. Get on the roof. Once he gets out of his fucking car, you need to shoot him or he'll kill you. He'll find you and he'll kill you. Hurry up! Oh, Jesus. Sorry. Slow. Steady. Get out, girl. Shoot him again! Wow, that easy. Somebody else in the house. Somebody else in the car? Mm -hmm. Look, I'm, 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 I'm almost there. You some bad man my jammers. We'll see y'all on the next one. We love you guys. <laughs> Bye. <Yeah. laughs>